guys welcome back my name is Charles Stanley from TS Tech Talk today I'm just going to be flexing out some new YouTube features on how to share your videos on other channels now let's go ahead and open YouTube youtube.com I'm just going to go directly to my channel so I'm going to add slash TS Tech Talk so that it will open direct to my channel So while it's loading, I guess you know you put some more features, which is this contact list and so many other ones in the dashboard end and also on the video end, editors end and several places. I'm just going to show you guys the easiest and the most um, fancy ones as of recent. Now, probably when you've uploaded your view and after watching and decide to share your video to, with your friends you could go ahead and click on this um icon here called share once you click on share button you'll be able to notice my recent activities um these ones right here are actually the ones i shared with my contact list so when you scroll you'll be able to see more people on my contact so i could actually share this video directly with my contact and you should make sure you watch my previous video on um let us see youtube new features which i discuss about the contact this is actually what i mean so if i want to decide to share a video with these guys i can just go ahead and click on them and then you can notice they are being selected you can notice i'm, I'm trying to send it to all these people and when i go back forth you can notice i'll be able to select as many as once they are already on my contact list i'll be able to send them this video directly on their contacts so that's the main use of into contact and i'm going to leave a description i'm going to leave a link to this um previous video so that you guys will be able to watch it so um after that I just go ahead and click on send you can notice um their names are showing right here so i'm actually sending this video to all these people on my contact list so once you're done just go ahead and click on send then the video is going to be sent to your contact list you can notice that it is sent to these people so they actually all the people in my contact list now let's go ahead and notice this um, share link here. Notice that if you want to share your video on your YouTube, your Twitter, your Google Plus, it's also simplified. And your blogger also. And you can notice they also added Reddit, which actually is the classic one. And when you scroll, you can still see other features like Tumblr, Pinterest, Viking, um, VK, sorry, and LinkedIn, and then your thumb. And then your tumble up and you could actually share with um email address so that's when you have the person's email address you can just click on it and it will navigate to your email account and then let me go back because i'm not trying to send to anyone's email address so it's very simplified now unlike before that the uh, actually it's almost the same thing just because they added new features so they have to make everything look different and look more broader so if you want to, you could also copy your link right here and then go and share it anywhere you want to share it. That's if um, some social media are not there yet because I don't think they will cover every social media because they still have some other social media side that is not showing up here. You can notice Instagram is not showing here and so many other ones. So you could just copy this link right here and then go share it on your whichever channel you want to share it. And then if you want to share this on your on facebook you could just click on facebook and then it will load up and then you'll be able to share it on your facebook timeline or you can just share it on a page and if you want to share it on a page very simple just go ahead and click on the drop down and then change this from timeline to page where well, my internet is slow today as well that it's loading okay now you could actually select a, a group or a page um i actually want to send it to a page i manage so let me go ahead and select the page and after you've selected a page, it's just going to show you some option. Um, okay, it's loading. Eh, while it's still loading, let me go ahead and write, add some write up. Let me see.
does that and then I should just say post but I can't post it because I'm still waiting for it to load okay now it's still loading now let's go ahead and select a particular approach which I manage and you can notice I manage lots of pages here but where I want you to go to is either intrinsic trend or TS tech talk so I'm already on TS tech talk so it's already selected automatically so let me go ahead and select it again and then you can see TS tech talk that's what I want to select now I could say um okay the I actually deleted the previous one the only way to fix YouTube error 500 so once I'm done adding this let's go ahead and click on post to Facebook and then it's going to be posted on my Facebook okay now it's posted and it's returning back to um, the same the same goes for Instagram um, Google Plus and the rest of them so which other way you want to share you could just go ahead and select whatever you want to share and then just share it and uh, don't forget to just um, if you just make sure you uh, mind where you are sharing your post you wouldn't share you wouldn't want to share it in the wrong place so it's either you actually do it public or and post yourself person in the wrong group so once you're done using it you could just close it and remember um there are still some things you can actually do whenever you're working on your video channel you could say start video at you could select where you want the video to start playing at whenever somebody is trying to view it you could just try to get your attention and just start the video um playing on zero i would suggest you start playing from 12 because then you would have bypassed the introduction area so if you're saying um start at 0 0.12 um, um, seconds you are saying it should start at 12 seconds that means it's actually going to start playing from here it won't start playing from the beginning so whenever you share this video wherever you're sharing this particular video and then it's definitely not going to start from the beginning it's going to start from 12 seconds so let's go ahead and go over to facebook again actually like sharing on Facebook because I have a lot of audience on Facebook so let me go to uh, this time around let's go to group and then um, which group name I have a YouTube group so I'm going to post it on YouTube um, if you are a group so I'm um, going to say the same thing only way to fix YouTube error 500 and then once i'm done i'm going to go ahead and post this post this message on youtube and then you should notice that whenever someone click on this particular video from the place i shared it it wouldn't start playing from zero seconds it will start playing from 12 seconds okay i hope you guys understand what i'm saying in this video and if you are getting confused and not understanding anything make sure you leave a comment for me below and don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel my name is trust stanley from TS Tech Talk. And if you have any um, reason or any video you want to, you want me to create for you, please do leave a comment below. Uh, thanks for watching.